Okay guys, what's up? Neff here. So we're playing control. Now, um, I still have these missions. I don't know how to do this, honestly. There's, there's um, a door and it's locked, so I don't know where to go. Better build a control, panopticon, levitate, bending of TV object. So where am I supposed to go? Contain itself P6. Am I getting some delays on my shit? I think I am, anyways. Technology. Oh. Upper. I went back and deal with the um, with the TV and the anchor, and now we're just gonna continue with the story. Uh, nope. Look this way. Where am I going again? Seriously. The guy with the fridge. Okay, I think I'm going this way. Wasn't I supposed to be up there already? Ah, god damn it. So we're going here. I have to go through an optical entrance. Is that it? Okay, yeah, let me just fast travel my way there. Oh crap. Wrong place. That took a while. Wow. Okay, now. Am I just at the same place? Yep, I'm at the same place. God damn it. Okay. Let me take the fucking elevator. Problem with me. I'm playing so many video games at the same time, like my brain. Still like how many places? One, two, three, four, five places here that has a question mark. Either I don't have a key or it's gonna be part of the story. Make that six. Sorry. It's where it was. Motherfucker. And you're close. Fuck you. Am I supposed to go somewhere? Containment P6 Am I supposed to look for P6? No, oh, there's actually symbols Or Where's P6? It's the elevator P6 I'm fucking lost man Containment 
Was I there before? Problem with this map is it doesn't say if it's second floor, third floor, like really? That's what I hate about maps that are just flat, they're not in 3D. I don't even know if I'm supposed to go to Firebreak, but fucking shit, man. There's no other place I can go. Not even a uh, way. Floor one. I have to get to the fifth floor. Okay, yeah. Let me try something here. I'm getting pissed. Enter, god damn it! My shit is slowing. I'm actually downloading Young Blood at the moment. Um, I'm actually in uh, at the moment. That's kind of dumb. Anyways, I'm downloading Young Blood. It looks fine on my left monitor where the game is. Second monitor where OBS is is kind of lagging, and it shows on the recording. And one other thing to mention, this game is released, I think it's been about two months, and there's still no fix with the problem with the render AI. That's still ongoing. Really. No one cares. If I go here. Am I just gonna go back? The altered item was. We got to levitate. Yeah, this is where it was. So I'm done with this area. Dylan. See, I was here. I'm done here. The question is, where am I going next? Whoa, is that a sniper rifle? Christ, that's a problem with me. They want me to just 
Whoa! I levitate my way up there? Is that it? I think so. Okay. So without dealing with the TV, I won't be able to continue with the story. I guess. first hello can you hear me Jesse who spoke again are you there Jesse Emily he's gone Dylan isn't here he might be nearby he or maybe there, the hiss got to him I don't know Jesse, listen. Dylan's here. With us. He just walked in. He says he is giving himself up. He's been affected by the hiss, but, but he is different than the others. We must isolate him. I'm on my way. We need to get back. I have to see my brother. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, fuck you. I wonder if there's something in here. Yep, nothing special. Yeah, nothing. So I was really meant to deal with the TV first. Without it, uh, I won't be able to get to this place. Oh shit! <sighs> Fuck me! Fuck me! Fuck me! <laughs> okay, I fell. That high. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go back there. I wanna see what's in that area. Let's press and hold, Neff. Press and hold.
I wonder if I can climb that. Go. No, I'm not high enough. Save point should be here. She have to write everything in her made-up gibberish code. Fuck. I don't think I ever told you this, but I was actually on the path to being a ranger once. Did the whole boot camp thing. Even got rookie status. Anyway, not the point. My own ranger squad was a great bunch. There was six plus me. Remus, Hazard, Cho, Guy, Hepton, Stall, and Thompson. They were supposed to get back from an expedition yesterday. We had beers and wings planned. Problem is... They weren't here when Darling handed out the HRAs. Then they had nothing protecting them from the hiss. You see, they prepped for the worst, but I think that we're already past that. We all wore these pouches around our neck, and I really don't want the hiss to get them. Could you find them for me? Uh, the squad would have come back through maintenance, but they probably spread out from there. I'll keep an eye out for them, Arish. And I won't let them stay hiss. I have to go. Not Me too. Now. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. Who are you? The resonance emitted from the HRAs is purely antithetical to... No, it's happening. After all these years, Dylan is here. Oh, but am I too late? How is he? I need to know. He's clearly been affected by the Hiss, but it's different than any other manifestation we've recorded. Maybe what makes you so special is genetic. He was a prime candidate. Or maybe it's Polaris protecting him, something else affecting the situation. I need to run tests. He seems more in control, more present. I want to see him. My brother? Or is he? Of course. And Marshall set up an HRA warded cage to contain him. It's on the upper floor, up the stairs. Okay, I need to go. Jesse, be careful. The game's lagging. And tell. Recording. Did you hear that this person? Level. In that room? Can hear humming. Similar to when there's like um, enemies. But I don't know. Things were stabilizing. Marshall abandons us. Comes white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror, inverted his mirror, right? 
Leave your hands at the back door. Push the fingers through the surface into the light. You've always been a new you. You are this control. We stand around you while you dream. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. We're all warm through time. The thunder's clear to start. Fuck. Happiness comes. White pearls with yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror, you are a warm through time. Shit. The thunder's home distorts you. That's Dylan. Can you hear me? Oh, come on, Dylan. I'm here. I found you. Do you know who I am? Oh, you know me. Say it. You are Dylan Faden's sister. Ooh. He's talking in the third, third person. person. Always a good sign. Do you know who you are? Not Dylan. Trench and Darling made sure of that. I'm P6. P6. Bond 6 but for chess. I'm better ink. now. The hiss made me better. Whoa. You've always been the new you. You want this. Can you stop that? Please. <sighs> Not exactly the reunion I'd hoped for. It feels good to say those words. I want to say them. That's they so weird. They sound good. They make me feel good. Don't you want to say them too? No. Fuck off, no. You need to help me get this thing out of his head. If he is still in there, if there is anything left, you have to you. help me. You! You came in through the hole in you! We let you in! You've always been here! The only child! A copy of a copy of a copy of a copy! Stop it! Orange field! Shit! Shit! He can see you. This is not safe. We found Polaris together with my sister when we were very small. In ordinary. In the desert, through the door opened up by the slide projector. But she didn't help when Trench took me away. She didn't give me any powers. All the powers are my own powers. <laughs> she didn't help when they locked me up for years. After the song time for applause, we build you till nothing remains. The air cracks and the truth will march out of you. You are home. The Bureau brought the slide projector back here with me. And the Bureau did what the Bureau does. They used it. And they found... They opened the door up to the hiss. That's the only thing I can thank them for. There. There it is. We stopped the altered world event in Ordinary when we shut down the slide projector. And now the projector's here. I'm here warm as a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. Baby, 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 yeah. Just plastic. So safe. Is it Justin Bieber? Nothing to worry about. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. Funny. I welcomed the hiss. I let it in. To get rid of her. The hiss set me free. Polaris is using you. The Bureau is using you. You are a puppet. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. If we shut off the slide projector, maybe, maybe that will stop the hiss. Maybe it's not too late for my brother. You must see the truth for yourself, Jesse. Sister. The horrible truth about the Bureau. The hiss is the better option. Go to the prime candidate program in the containment sector. I have the key card to get you there. Salvador wanted me to have it. Wanted? Bullshit. I saw what the hiss did to Salvador. What it turned him into. Okay, Dylan. I'll go. I want to see the truth for myself. I'll go. But only to look for this lie projector. You can help me. We can end this. You are a warm 
through time. You are a worm through time. The thunderstorm distorts you. I don't know what else I'm hoping to find here. Dylan. Can we talk? Want some ice cream? I'd like to tell you about a dream I had last night. Off to a good start. Okay. I'm listening. I was back in ordinary. Before all of this happened. But in the dream, I was alone. It was just me. I was the only child. A girl. My name was Jesse Dylan Faden. But then the Bureau came and caught me, brought me back here, locked me up. Have you ever noticed that our names, Jesse, Dylan, they could be girls' names, boys' names, could be anything. Don't you find that weird? I find that weird. Sure. What the hell was that? Is he trying to mess with me? You are a worm through time. The thunder so You think this game has to end? Is either Dylan's dead or he's alive? Maybe Dylan's still in there. Maybe there's a way to reach him. I'd like to talk to my brother, please. Dylan? Dylan would like to tell you about a dream he had just now. This again? I was going to be the new director of this place. I helped you get a job here so that we could be together. You were an office assistant. You'd make coffee and deliver the mail, and there was always plenty of work to do. And it stayed that way, forever and ever. It was nice, really nice. That's debatable. But here's the strange thing. The dream shifted, and none of it was real anymore. It was a game. We were in a game, and it was a fucking boring game. But you couldn't stop playing. Ooh, shots fired. And then it shifted again. Or, or maybe it was another dream already. Or, or maybe I'm just confusing them. But in this other dream, it was more like a musical. This is an ordinary song about an ordinary girl from an ordinary town. It's the ordinary story. She worked an ordinary job in an ordinary office and something, 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 something. And that's all I can remember of that dream. Maybe that's for the best. You gotta give it to the voice the actor, Dylan, though. He makes it way creepy. You, you gotta admit, this game is, at some point, it's a bit boring. Unless you're really fighting enemies. Maybe I can learn more about the hiss from him. Let's see. We're gonna keep can we talking talk? to him. Let the whole thing repeat before he doesn't see I just it. had an interesting dream. Oh, shit. That's fascinating, but... Let's talk about the hiss for a change, yeah? This dream was about the hiss. Uh, that's what I'm gonna get. In my dream, the hiss had broken free of this prison, this house. I'd set it free. And the president himself was there to welcome us. He was the first one to take the hiss in. Spread the word. Huh? At first, many people thought it was horrifying. That he was horrifying. But also, many people who heard his words wanted to welcome the hiss in. And slowly, more and more of them came around. 
until the whole world was brought together by the hiss. It was wonderful. Okay, thanks for sharing that. For the record, that will never happen. Not as long as I'm alive. That's what is going to distort you. Maybe I'm just here to punish myself. Any new dreams you'd like to share, Dylan? I'm glad you asked, sister. There's more? Are you serious? This dream, like all dreams now, felt very real. Like reality. And reality now feels like a dream. Maybe it's all a dream. Maybe I'm a Maybe dream. Maybe it's all real. You're a dream. We're all a dreams. Dream where my brother endlessly tells me about his dreams. I was in a dark place. And there was a dark man there. His name was Mr. Door. And he told me that there are many worlds side by side on top of each other, some inside of others. In one world, there was a writer who wrote a story about a cop. In another world, the cop was real. Dor said he himself was in all of them at the same time, endlessly shifting between them. I asked him how I could reach these worlds. I wanted to bring the hiss there. But he didn't want to help me. He didn't like the idea. What did he know? I'm not wild about the idea myself. So now we're dealing with multiverse. Here we go again. Once more with feeling. Let me guess. You want to tell me about your dream? Yes. Yes. In fact, I'm having a dream right now. The fuck? Oh. That's new. In this dream, I'm standing in the corner watching Jesse and Dylan talk about this very dream. <laughs> this very dream! He said just now! And repeated it again now! I'm standing there and watching and that's all I can do. It's as if I'm trapped there and that's all I have to say about that dream okay okay Dylan that's good is he still in there or is this the hiss playing mind game okay so I ran out <laughs> that's it Jesus Christ why have you dissected that free communication? You got anything else to say to me? Hey, I put extra security on your brother. No offense, but that dude is the scariest motherfucker I have ever laid eyes on. Like I said, though, no offense. I think you're... I have to go. It's a, you're not the only one who's busy, you know. See if you have something new. Oh, the files all over. How are you doing, Jesse? It can't be easy seeing Dylan like this. I'm fine. What can you tell me? Is he still human, or is he his? I've taken numerous tissue samples and have tests running as we speak, but from the initial data, he looks healthy. I only see corruption in a superficial way. What does that mean? I don't know. This is all new. But if he's like you, maybe Polaris is preventing total his takeover. Or maybe this is just a new form of his. We've already seen how it affects people in different ways. Dylan told me he let the his in. Does that change anything? Voluntary conversion. I mean, hypothetically, that could affect the mental state post-corruption, as well as the extent of biological alteration. But again, this is new territory for me. I I'll need time. You won't have it. 
I'm gonna shut down the slide projector. That's how the hiss are getting in. Once I close it, this should all be over. Jesse, we don't know how this works. If you sever their connection to the source, it could cause a terminal chain reaction. Every his corrupted individual dead. Better that than what Dylan is now. I'm shutting it down. This has to end. Whatever happens, happens. Okay, just let me know how I can help. Thank you, Emily. After this, is she gonna stay working here and be the new director? I don't know. Maybe? She getting paid? Anyways, I'm gonna stop the recording here and I'll just continue the next one. You can like and subscribe if you want to. Yeah, again, I'll just see you in the next one. This game.